Hello Cancer, welcome to your monthly gemstone reading. This is a very general reading for the sign of Cancer for the month of July and it is Cancer season. Most of July is dominated by Cancers. Um, so I am going to be adding extra cards to this reading as a gift too. I do that for every sign too. And yeah, so happy birthday to all you Cancers out there and the ones that had the end of June. I'm, an, I'm a Cancer, end of June Cancer, hello. <laughs> Okay, so, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, so let's get started. Okay, Cancer, you got a lot going on. communications it's sideways okay there's going to be a lot of things communicated this month this means messages talks uh things like that happening but there's two sides of it okay so make sure you get all the facts before you assume anything this month as well so i'm seeing that energy love is in focus hurt feelings lifestyle health and well-being is showing up um I do see something very nice coming through, but you've got a lot of things going on and a lot of people around you have a tower too. Your perspectives is going to change a lot, okay? Even you overall, there's a lot of changes that are coming through. There is some negativity around some people around. around. These are people who are, um, they don't even act their age, so I wouldn't even listen to them. They're either inferior somehow, they're not um, good for you. Um, just, you're kind of letting that go. Okay, so some certain opinions that are coming through, things like that. But you could be very opinionated this month as well. Okay, but you do have this beautiful energy coming through here. I do see dealing either with children. These are little, um, these are hurt feelings too coming through. So it's a lot, lot. Okay, I'm going to try to get, get this. It's a little bit of negative with the home foundation. You definitely are going to be make, making some major changes yourself. Okay, because there's you overall changing up. Your internal self, your external self, I'm seeing all of that. Um, a lot of things are happening this month which are going to greatly affect you. Um, you're going to be changing a lot of things where people are not going to be, you know, they may be surprised. There's a lot of activity with home. Maybe you'll be changing. Okay, um, let's say you could maybe change homes. Maybe you'll paint your house different. You may change your appearance somehow, okay? Um, you may be redoing some things. You may also, you know, change your hairstyle, your wardrobe. Also, it's not just that. It's not just an appearance. It's a deeper level. And it may be also uh, your daily routines, uh, your physical habits, uh, things like that. You're going to revamp a lot. I see a lot of readjustments going on. It's pretty deep here. Okay, so I see that. Either way, once you get started, though, on your new path, you'll be tough to stop. Okay, you are just determined to go through this. Um, I also see that you may be um, starting new diets because health, well-being, all of that is showing up here. Uh, exercise, something of that nature also is coming through very strongly. I do see also relationships are really coming into focus here. Um, I do see major changes are going to be happening there. Okay, so we're seeing all that um, coming through. But I do also see it, it's not just romantic ones. It's platonic relationships all in general. Um, I do see others are going to be very drawn to you too, for good or for bad. Now, I would really make sure you be careful who you do bring into your circle. Okay, so I see people drawn to you and they're going to be more than happy to spend time in your company. There is a little bit of a warning to investigate, um, research people that that are new that come into your um, into your life. Okay, these are like new groups um, of interesting, unusual type of people may be coming in. But it's good to investigate them, research, make sure that you know who you're dealing with, things like that, because you don't want to start some negative cycle with someone because you're kind of purging things out. I do see definitely. Um, legalities or this could be a major purchase um 
a major decision. Maybe you want to, you may be buying a home. This could be dealing with legalities though, okay? Um, a legal document, signing something like that. Okay, you're making this heavy decision. Um, something comes through in your favor and you're definitely, <clears throat> you make this decision and you're moving forward. You're definitely leaving something behind. So that is for some of you out there too, okay? So I'm seeing that energy. You're definitely gonna be walking away from some stuff. It's like, ugh, I'm done with this. I don't care anymore. Um, I do see um, third people's opinions, things like that. People who've interfered in your relationship or in your life, clearing and purging. It's like even their words. It's like you may be coming and lashing out at them. But I'll tell you something. You um, trust your intuition. You know. Some may be trying to cause some confusion, but you, you've got clarity. You know. Okay? Because you got the intuitive stone there. So you definitely know that. Um you are definitely in focus, okay? There's definitely going to be a turn of events, a little bit of high anxiety. New people and experiences definitely coming through travel and a journey ahead. Beautiful energy. It's like a rebirthing. You love a uh, renewal of love, but you also have high creative energy, okay? So I see that too. Um, maybe having a hard time expressing yourself somehow as well. There is some jealousy around you too. It's on the side, but you're kind of kicking it off. It's not, it's not going to be able to affect you. Um, I do see also um, you have some very important people or person around who's going to be able to help you, give you some clarity or just you're going to have some very strong support that's going to bring you eventually some troubles that are going to be leaving. This is beyond this month, I see, where you've been feeling trapped. There is going to be a um, things are suddenly going to go your way. It's like the world will open up for you. But I, I see that coming be uh, after this month and down the road okay this could be like in maybe august or even more down the road um you're going to regain yourself okay so that's definitely something that i do see okay um yeah okay i guess that's about it let me pull some cards Definitely new people, new experiences coming in. So just kind of check people out before. It's like so many changes that are going to deeply affect you. You have healing. Let me push these up because I'm going to have to put the other cards up. You have healing, you have forgiveness. And you have nature. Okay, so this is what's showing up for you guys. Overall, you healing. Healing from pains, healing from either physical illnesses or anything. There is a healing, soothing um, experience coming overall with you guys. So it's like, you, especially you're making some kind of changes. I do see overall situations of people around you, forgiveness, okay? So it's like either forgive, move on. Um, maybe some coming to ask you for forgiveness. I see you drawing in people as well. Either way, forgiveness is coming through. Okay, and you're in, this is your indicated card, your subconscious energies, um, the underlining energy of what's coming through, it's important as nature. So go out to the park, um, go um, do a simple gardening, um, just sit underneath a tree, read, um, connect with nature is very, very important and soothing. Okay, it may even give you epiphanies or something too. Um, I do that. When I get stressful, really stressed, and we all get stressful, and I'm, you know, I go through a lot. I just don't talk about it on YouTube. Um, I run out to the park, and thanks to my darling husband, he's like, you know, you need to take breaks, or you need to do this and that, whatever, or if you're home. And if it's just a half hour, half hour, just get out there. It's still going to do you some good. So connecting to nature is going to be very important. Okay, so this could mean, you know, taking vacations, maybe go hiking, um, trailing. I don't know. It's just nature's coming through very strongly. And I do see travel. It's going to be very nice, too. Okay, so let's pull some more cards here. All right, you have the Three of Cups. That's your overall energy. So there's going to be celebrations. Yes, it's your birthday month, too. Nice get-together, something to celebrate. Very nice friendships. Um, teaming up. It's very nice. Now your underlining energy is the five of cups. Okay. Though everything is going to be still pretty good and a lot of things around you are going well, there is something that's still bothering you. There is something that's still just not quite there. Okay. So do be careful of depression or maybe sometimes it just being your head thinking of the past or, you know, go back to this card. Okay. So keep the <laughs> energy. Okay. So then you have the queen of wands. Queen of Wands, same thing, Magician. So far, good. 
Okay, um, the Nine of Wands, Four of Pentacles, and one more, and you have the King of Wands. Okay, so you kind of got a mixed bag here. You've got a lot of high energy here this month, too. The Queen of Wands, definitely beautiful energy here. Um, very creative energy too. You could be attracting a lot this month. I saw that too. You may be, um, like I said, redoing yourself somehow inside, outside, matching what is right for you. You have the magician. So let's know that, uh, everything's manageable. Things can just work out. Um, it's you. Sometimes this comes out as a yes answer. So just know, yes, you can really manifest a lot here as above. So below get rid of the negativity. And you never know what can come through. You know, just believe in magic. That's another way I look at that for real. It's the magician. You have the nine of wands. So there is um, a, something that is telling me, again, that you could be a little bit overwhelmed, um, a little bit cautious. And it does indicate to be cautious. I did see that in gemstones where, especially new people, new situations coming around. But this also can indicate um, beware of your surroundings. There could be jealousy around too, surrounded by jealousy. Um, I do see four of pentacles. You could be in your mind a lot too, but this is also very stubborn energy. Um, thinking too much money, you know, my money's on the mind too. Um, I do see also, okay. I see the, the, the king of wands too here. So you could be a lot to your, yourself, but this does create some nice, very nice, um, creative energy coming through and decisions that maybe you have to be made that you have to make even fire sign energy could be very significant um at this time too you know when i'm looking at this i feel that because this can indicate also passion relationship love you're you, you're going to be showing showing deeper um not emotions you're your devotions okay so you're going to be really showing and expressing your um deepest devotions okay i think that's the way i want to say it and it is with relationships okay but you need to kind of slow down a bit there's this energy here that tells me kind of slow down um showing them a little bit too soon okay um try to hold back a little okay just to make sure that um like i said there's a sense of anything new new people new love whatever's coming through investigate it first so kind of try to hold it back a little watch for a little bit of low energy this month too um it's like i feel self-expression you may feel tongue-tied okay i just see something like that coming through too and um this could be even some kind of below the surface power struggles going on okay self-expression isn't the easiest too okay keeping more to yourself i see here too so maybe you're not uh, it's going to be hard time for you to um be able to self-expression isn't going to be the easiest is what i'm seeing you may be dealing with je uh, issues of jealousies uh, jealousy around and even revenge okay so i do see that but it can be um some kind of misunderstandings too so make sure everyone's on the right same page um, you have, you know, make sure you have all the facts, all the information, see what's going on too. Talk is going to be important, expressing yourself, talking, okay? You may feel someone is out to get you, okay? And you may be right. I don't know. Everybody's different, but just be, there is a sense of being cautious, okay? C communication is going to be really key, okay? And we saw that here too with the communications on the side, two sides. So this is actually making sense. Okay, look at things from stepping up, stepping on the side of any situation, um, like you do, like observe, 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 like from a stranger's point of view. Okay, you got this cancer, you got it, don't worry. <laughs> I see creative sparks coming through too, you can really manifest a lot too. Um, these could be exciting new projects and coming through too, very productive time um and uh great uh creative solutions coming through as well and a lot of things can just happen you have the tools there as well so below you can manifest a lot too this is a good card to have too all right remember healing forgiveness and nature too okay cancer well i again want to wish you all a happy birthday if you would like a private um personal july monthly reading it's on discount still available 
um, on my website. Otherwise, I hope you have a wonderful birthday month, a wonderful month ahead, and I'll catch you back next month for your next reading. Until then, all the best. Bye for now.